Good morning, good morning, good morning. I thought the last video would be my sixth video, but it was my fifth video. Um, cause I can believe I can only down upload six videos a day. So this is my sixth one right here. Um, and it's gonna come from Hebrews eleven verse six. Hebrews eleven verse six. But without faith it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to God must believe that he is, and that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him again. But without faith it is impossible to please him. You know you have a hair in your mouth? You feel like hair in your mouth before? Okay. But without faith it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to God must believe that he is. And that he is a rewarder of them that diligently seek him. And this is Hebrews 11 verse 6. And I take it this to me. All right, all right. Um, before um, before you um, now, if you don't have any faith, if you don't have any faith, if you don't have any belief in the God that you serve, you're not pleasing Him. Because like I said, you first you must believe that He is. He is a God. He is a God. He is the God. You know, there's no one, none other like him. Before or after. And you must believe that he is. And he's a, re a rewarder. Of those that diligently seek him. Those who really want to be saved. Who want the Lord to change their life. You know, who want to live for the Lord, who want to please the Lord, who want to um, hear in the end, well done. Because it's like, if you don't have faith, it's impossible to please Him. So if you got, I, mean, I remember one time. Oh my stars, uh, this, uh, I go back, I keep going back to this example, but it was like, oh um, my son in his school, uh, I, I, you know, I had, I had been told, just don't go, just, you know, let it rest, whatever, you know, leave it alone, and see, I didn't know what to do. I God knows all. I I didn't know what to do, so I I was, I had been, you know. First of all, I was crying. I, I didn't know if I was crying, uh, really about the circumstances or you know what, you know. I just didn't. I, I just know that I didn't know what to do, and I was explaining to people, you know, I was trying to explain to he and she about this and that, but they didn't understand. All they had was. Ready or not, let it go, or just, you know, go on, accept the answer. But I refuse to do that. I refuse to accept the answer that they gave me. And I had faith in God. I said, I, said, I gotta go. I gotta go through this process. And I had to meet with the superintendent over Hillsborough County School. Would you imagine? Can you imagine that? Little old me, me with the superintendent over Hillsborough County schools, the whole county school. He was took, he took out the time to meet with me. You know who am I? You know so. Anyhow, um, I went through that. We went through that. Went through the whole process, and it was looking bleak or dim or whatever. 
And then at the end, he said, wait a minute. Wait a minute. But he was going over the um, paper. He said, oh, uh-uh. He's promoted. This is so wrong. Because he saw, he said he got three, one, two, three. And he got a point over there. Because I made him go attend summer school. Because I had, I had said, you never know. I... You know, I had said you go to summer school, which they were saying, uh, not to repeat or whatever. But I was saying, in how it's going to make you credit or something for whatever. I didn't know. I didn't know what I was doing. I was just depending on God. And, you know, lo and behold, a whole lot transpired between, you know, then and then. And, Come to find out, my son had the point to where he could be promoted. But somehow, for some reason, they didn't see their extra point. They thought this or they thought that. And they would left him back, you know. But, I, you know, I had to take it further. I was a mother. That was my son. You're not going to do this with him. You're not going to do this. I mean, you know, I was present. I was there. I wasn't an absentee mother. I was there. And you know, I had to have faith in God. You know, God God gave me the faith. He, you know, I had strengthened my faith in Christ. You know, it was just lovely. You know, just when I went through everything, how I came out, you know, how the Lord brought me out. When the Lord brought me out, y'all, when he brought me out, it was just like a big weight lifted off of my shoulder. It's so amazing how you just feel so carefree. I, was, I didn't realize it was, it was a trial, but that was a trial, maybe. You know, the testing of my faith. And, you know, I didn't even realize that. And, you know, I just thank praise God that, you know, I did go through. I did pass, you know, I, I give him all the glory. I give God up in heaven all the glory. Peace out. You better serve him. You don't want to know what you're missing.